Wineguard Extreme 2.0 installation. The Wineguard Extreme 2.0 can be installed on a structure using the adjustable foot mount or attached to a pole using the pole mount adapter. After choosing your desired location, skip to the timecode on the screen for your chosen installation. Adjustable foot mount installation. Attach the adjustable foot mount at your desired location. Hardware to attach the adjustable foot to the structure is not provided. Attach the L-pipe by inserting a bolt with washer into the single hole of the mount foot going through the L-pipe. Adjust the angle of the L-pipe until the front of the L-pipe is as vertical as possible. Insert the additional bolt with washer into the appropriate hole in the mount foot going through the bottom slot of the L-pipe. Secure the bolts in place using the washers and nuts. Tighten using a 7 16 wrench. Skip to the timecode on the screen for the steps to attach the antenna to the L-pipe and connecting the Ethernet cable. Pole Mount Adapter Installation When mounting the antenna on a pole, the diameter of the pole should be no more than one and a quarter inches. Begin by sliding the U-bolts around the mast, then the mast clamps onto the U-bolts. Slide the pole mount adapter onto the U-bolts and secure in place using the provided nuts. Tighten the nuts using a 7 16 wrench. Slide the L-pipe into the pole mount adapter and secure in place using the provided bolt and nut. Tighten using a 7 16 wrench. Attaching the antenna to the L-pipe and connecting the Ethernet cable. Using the black screws, attach the circular insert adapter to the bottom of the Extreme 2.0 unit. Slide the L-pipe into the insert adapter and secure in place using the provided bolt and nut. Tighten with a 7 16 wrench. The Ethernet cable should be no more than 85 feet in length between the antenna and the indoor power inserter. We recommend using a Cat5, Cat5e, or Cat6 Ethernet cable. Slide the Ethernet cable through the hole in the cover plate. Slide the grommet over the Ethernet cable. Insert the grommet into the cover plate. To ensure a proper seal, the grommet should be smooth around the edges and flush against the cover plate on both sides. Plug the Ethernet cable into the Extreme 2.0 unit and make sure you hear it click. Slide the cover plate in place and use the two screws to secure the cover plate to the antenna. Run the Ethernet cable to the location of the power inserter. The power inserter is for indoor use only and should not be installed outside. Plug the Ethernet cable into the port marked PoE. Plug the power inserter into a wall outlet and the system will power on. Congratulations, you have successfully installed your Weingart Extreme 2.0. If you need assistance with setting up your system, please see our Weingart Extreme 2.0 setup videos.